Hey guys, today I'm going to talk about a hilarious meme that is making its way around the internet. It is the Ultimate Masters Booster Box, or 30 free Taco Bell Party Packs. Of course, I had to make my own meme, which is a copy of this meme, but with, you guessed it, Junior Bacon Cheeseburgers. Now, this is actually an interesting, interesting comparison. $335 is a lot of money. I know a lot of people don't believe it's a lot of money, and those people don't have the money to buy it. So it's kind of like $335 is a lot of money for pretty much everybody because it can buy you 33 times 12 tacos. So tacos, per taco, it's 83 cents per taco. Per card at MSRP, it's 93 cents per card. You get lots of different tacos when you only get really one pack per box. And you can share those tacos. So what would be more popular at a FNM or a GP? Somebody giving tacos to 400 people or someone opening a box of Ultimate Masters. Which gets me to my next topic. But what if we one-upped it? So a taco is kind of cheap. It's more for the popper players. What if we went with a Junior Bacon Cheeseburger? Now these are about 380 calories a piece. And they go for $1.99. Essentially, we can buy 150 plus about 17 and a half. We can buy 167 and a half Junior Bacon Cheeseburgers. Let me write that down. 167 and a half Junior Bacon Cheeseburgers. Or we can buy a box of crap. It's up to you guys. Do you want to eat cheeseburgers? That's like a cheeseburger every day. At the taco, it's you're eating a taco every day. Can you imagine that a taco is cheaper than any of the cards? So as soon as you're done opening your booster pack, that was uh, 15 tacos. Isn't that crazy? That was 15 tacos or seven and a half Junior Bacon Cheeseburgers. Now, what else can you get? You can get about 17... I mean, the it used to be a dollar menu, but now it's like the $2 menu pretty much. And you can get anything you want off the $2 menu times 167 and a half. That is like insane. Uh, you can also buy Nintendo Switch. You can buy... You know what? Here, here's, here's the deal. I'm actually kind of curious how many junior bacon cheeseburgers I can eat because I want to see if I can eat one booster pack worth of junior bacon cheeseburgers. So that would be seven and a half. No, or seven. So if I had to eat the box topper, the box topper being at 40 to five, what was the box topper? $55. I would need to eat 25 26 no that's impossible i can't eat 26 that's too much so i will have a contest where i will buy a set amount of junior cheeseburgers and i will eat them assuming that this channel is allowed to live stream which currently it's not because of things that have happened to my documentary on frank and friends i will go ahead and I will have a contest and we'll open some Modern Masters 25 because I have just a ton of that. Uh, we'll give that away to whoever can best guess how many cheeseburgers. And that includes, I think we're going to go down to like quarters or eighths. That way it kind of limits it. And I'm not going to cheat or anything. I'm just going to eat and eat and eat until I cannot eat anymore. And that will be the amount of, I mean, look at this image. I mean, it's just so amazing. I can understand why people, MTG content creators, just go ham for this type of stuff. I mean, look at it, 380 calories. 
I think I, if I had to guess, I could probably eat a booster pack worth of cheeseburgers. But maybe two booster packs. I think two booster packs is really pushing it. Uh, that's, that's like insane. Uh, but I'm dead serious. In protest of Ultimate Masters, I will go ahead and buy cheeseburgers, a amount that I don't think I can eat, and then I will eat them. And protest. So a lot of times people protest by going on a hunger strike. This is the reverse protest because I'm protesting against excess by eating. No, hold on. I probably, no, no hunger strike. No, no hunger strike. Just eating junior cheeseburgers. And then there'll be giveaways. There'll be a fun event. I'm actually dead serious. I am dead serious about this. Uh, we'll pick a charity and then, you know, we'll have prizes and all types of good stuff. So would you rather have a Ultimate Masters Booster Box or 33 Taco Bell Party Packs? The most astounding thing is every card, there's 15 cards per pack is 93 cents, which means every single pack is seven and a half Junior cheeseburgers. Junior bacon cheeseburger. Remember, there's bacon in it. I forgot. I keep forgetting the bacon, but that's probably the most important part. I don't think I can even eat two packs of this stuff. Like, it just doesn't... I 15 cheeseburgers, I, I, just, I don't think I can do it. But I will try my best. Because look at how happy this burger is. Look how beautiful it is constructed. Um, I mean, it just looks amazing. So if I am able to eat seven and a half, I think that's probably my goal. That's about 3,000 calories in one sitting. That seems like a lot. I don't know if I can eat a booster pack. Yeah, so anyway, our channel is going to be me trying to eat the food, me buying food from various established restaurants, uh, of high class restaurants and seeing what we can get for the $14. Can I eat? Can I finish fast food? I'll, I'll go ahead and get the taco pack and I'll try to eat that one. For... I mean, it's just so ridiculous if you think about it. Uh, McDonald's has a dollar menu so I can get actually 14 cheeseburgers. I'm totally serious. I'm going to go ahead and do it. Uh, I want you guys to comment what food I should eat. Uh, it has to be fast food, of course. Or it can be like really... There's a uh, Chinese restaurant that Jess and I go to at nighttime. It's part of a gas station. And that's all I'm going to say. It's part of a gas station. So you know how like sometimes they have Burger King and you know like... No, no. This is like a independently run gas station that is like in the middle of nowhere. It's next to a laundromat. Uh, when I first moved to Houston, I didn't have, when I first moved to my home, my laundry machines, they got delayed. So I went to the laundromat and that's how I found the place. But the food is really bad, but it's so bad. It reminds me of like the food I had at NYU, which is like really good memory. So like, uh, and Jess loves it. So I will go ahead and do a challenge. I'll open some packs because I know that we have to be, quote, a magic channel. And I know that I have to open a pack, a few packs in the beginning and a few packs at the end, and then suddenly we're a magic channel, right? That's all you guys care about. And I will, in the middle, purchase X amount of food equivalent to a booster pack, or if I'm feeling very famished, two booster packs, and I will eat. I will eat until I cannot eat anymore. And that will be in my new series. Can I eat a booster pack of Ultimate Masters. Now, at the higher end, I'm gonna take you guys, I might take you to some nicer restaurants because a box topper is $55. So my next episode, my next uh, series will be, can I, what can you get for $55 eating in Houston? It's a lot of great food. Uh, $55 will go very far. So look at this majestic creature, this majestic beast. It symbolizes so much in our community. Look at that crispy bacon, that fresh lettuce, that bun, and the never frozen beef. 
<laughs> Such a show. Anyway, I I found out I found out meme. Oh, I mean, look at this. Look at this. I mean, it is. Uh, I don't even think this is from Wendy's, is it? It's from Jack in a Box. I can tell. I think this is from Jack in a Box, but they labeled it Wendy's too. This. I think Jack in a Box took the picture of their own product and labeled it Wendy's to discourage people from eating at Wendy's. I think that's what happened. You know, I would um, be grateful if uh, we could get some other YouTubers, one in particular, to join me on this challenge. I think it would be helpful and beneficial for everybody. I'm going to do it. I'm dead serious. I mean, this is like what it should look like. I mean, I don't, I've never had a, any food from Wendy's that looked remotely close to this, but I guess this is the ideal version. This is kind of the YouTube version. So the real version is what you just saw. This is the YouTube version where they cut and edit and they make stuff up. And someone who doesn't even play magic can suddenly become a great magic content creator. Although they don't even have a magic collection or a local game store. Anyway, but I, I just love that meme. I thought that meme was the best. And obviously, we had to get over the 10 minute mark, right? Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I think we're over 10 minutes. Bye.